Hey guys, Britta here. Welcome back to Farming Simulator 2019 and our Rags to Riches series here at Lapinki, episode number 21. So, overnight, I've got our stuff all back here. Our field number two is ready to go. It is fully fertilized. Um, I did turn off weeds. I'll turn them back on now. Um, just so I could let it go through the night without me having to worry too much. Um, I've done a bit more landscaping around here just to make it look more legit in and out of here. Um, also around here, and I've also picked up our car. Look at this bad boy. It's pretty awesome. The Mosk Moskovich 407. Sounds pretty good. So you probably won't move very often, to be honest. But um, got our ho top still here. We've got our Fortress 323 here. At the animal dealers, picked up four horses ready to come back. We are in debt now, fortunately. Um, so this animal trailer, it's pretty good, but I am having some dramas with it as well, which you guys will probably see. Um, I've not been way too bloody long. <laughs> you guys will probably see these dramas on the way back. You can probably see them now, actually. Like now, I'm stuck on something. What am I stuck on? Like there's nothing even there. Stuck on nothing. This is what's um, frustrating me a little bit. So there's another name there. Stara Huta is another name. Alright, so let's continue on around the map. We need to go up here and see that's the problem. Everything we just keep hitting nothing and it is really really honestly truly it has really shit me up the wall I don't know if it's something to do with the mod or if it's something to do with the map but there's nothing there's like nothing here that I'm getting hit I'm hitting things like what the hell I said I'm usually not very critical oh for god's sake critical of people that do mods but seriously test test your mods before you release them please like there's nothing even here and we're getting stuck on something it is an absolute joke to be honest I have no idea what is going on the trailer is getting stuck on something and it's complete and utter crap so we need to get these horses back as quick as we can um, and just I'm just going to well and truly get rid of this mod Throw it out the window. I'm not going to bother. Once again, what are we hitting on? Nothing. There's not a thing there. Now I'm stuck in the tree, but there was nothing before that. Like, what the hell do some of these people do when they test their mods? Could it be the cover? I don't know. It wouldn't, you wouldn't think it would be the cover. Now the cover's off, it seems to be going okay I know I'm driving through fields and stuff and but I literally at this point in time I don't care I just want to get this back get these horses out and this trailer can go back to the shop get rid of this delete these mods from my FS19 folder and completely forget about them we might struggle up this hill it's probably the issue here that's probably not the trailer itself it's probably the tractor not having enough oomph so we'll give it a bit of a hand. Which obviously isn't ideal. But, come on. We're going to try and... Oh, come on, come on, come on. Get going. Alright, so if we're going to animal transport... It's this one. So I don't know if that one's any better. Probably not. They're in the exact same... They're by the exact same author, so they're probably both the bloody same, to be honest. Which is a shame, because the trailers actually look pretty good. They sort of fit with what we're going with here, but it's just... I said I try not to be... See? Far out. I try not to be too critical of people and modders in general, but this is just... Honestly, 
like, if I could swear and get away with it, I would, but I don't, because I don't like to swear on my channel, but this is very frustrating. Like, if I was not recording, I would be swearing the house down right now. Oh, far out. I cannot wait to get rid of this shit out of here, seriously. It is frustrating. I know you guys are probably having a bit of a chuckle. Oh, come on. Ugh. Seriously. If I could get a big bomb and throw it under this bloody thing right now, I would. Let's go. Let's go. We're nearly there. These sh stupid horses out of this stupid trailer. This stupid farm. Bloody hell, come on. So it's hitting on something which is stopping the trailer, the tractor from moving. There's nothing even there. I'm really at the stage where I'm sort of getting frustrated and I'm over mods. I might just go back and start again at Fellsbrun or something and just go 100% vanilla. Forget about mods altogether. That's really where I'm sort of out of them. That was me. Out at the moment. Like I'm just 100% over some of these things. Alright, you can... Edward and Queen, get out of there. Get out of there. Get in there. Do whatever you want to do. I don't care. Alright, um, get rid of these two as well. Into here. Yep. Done. Confirm. Uh, got that. Get rid of this. And... Blow that up. See you by. Um, right, let's shut these faint fences so the horses don't get out. Right, let's go. We've got some harvesting to do. Um, also, animals. We now have the trailer that I meant to have in the game, the fortress. So by you, now we have some money and you can be used for our water. So you need water, oat, and hay. We don't have any hay. We don't have any water. We don't have any straw. We don't have hardly bloody anything. But we're going to have have your oats very, very soon. And hay, well, probably not that far away from getting hay. Um, and straw. So we're right there. Right there. Right, so we're jumping now. Harvester here, the row top. Start it up. Head on down to our our field. Try not to destroy anything on the way. So I put in roads around here as well, as I said, roads up there. Got rid of oh Jesus. Got rid of the majority of the bushes in that in that field up there, so we can come and actually mow that without running over bushes. That's another thing we need to look at, is mowers. We still have both of these guys from the last uh, version. So, I don't know what one we're going to go with. But we're going to have to get one of those in, mow that, turn it into hay, either bale it or pick it up. And um, we'll with a loading wagon and get it into the animals. With our loading wagons, we do have this guy which picks up um, one of them is straw, is it not? I always forget. Down is grass. That's grass. Or is it? That's grass. That's straw, and the other one's hay, I think. Oh, I don't know. I can't remember. One of them is like that. Alright, so let's stop here, drop our trailer off. Unfold our harvester, pick up our header, and this harvester should make short work of this field. Make sure we have shore scythe enabled, we do. Right, pick this guy up. Back, back to here. Try not to run over our neighbor's field, or harvest our neighbor's field. Can't go up or down. 
Yeah, yeah, I don't know. In or out? In or out? Go in. Let's go. Harvesting some oats, throwing out some. Ah, um, uh, okay. Straw, raw. I don't know. It doesn't look straw to me. No idea what we're throwing out at the moment, but it's certainly not straw. Remember it's actually um, hay or something like that. This um, harvester is quite loud as well. So you're getting thrown in the back there. Let's have a look from outside. Getting thrown in. A little window to see. To the side. We've got look at those working parts in there. That is awesome. Now this is a bloody good mod. Looks like it's coming out of straw. But when it hits the ground, it's changing to something else. So I don't know. Now it's straw or something else we're going to be picking up in a minute. Right. So we've we're... got a fair bit of oak in there already. Whatever we get from our first unload of our harvest, we'll take straight down to our horses. Feed those guys, hopefully get them happy, and then um, after that we'll head and sell the rest of it. Don't know if that's... Looks like it's turning into straight grass. It's weird. I don't know, I hope it's not an issue with the map. It might be an issue with the mod. I mean, every time we go and use a new bloody mod, we always find an issue with it somewhere. Unfortunately. So I'm gonna stop you there. I'm gonna go all the way back to this end and then start again because we're gonna have to unload him very shortly. We're gonna have to unload from this side. Oh, where's the pipe? There it is. Ah, that's pretty cool. Hiding away in there. I didn't even see it to start with. You can head back this way. Off you go. Grab this guy. You can come and unload. And then we're going to have to look at trying to either get a loading wagon or a baler. Now I hope that um, that is actually straw that we're going to pick up from under there. If it's not, we're going to have some dramas. Might be another sell this harvester and go back to vanilla harvester, the bison. At least we know this thing does the right thing. It sort of fits where we are as well, but I'd rather keep this guy. This guy looks awesome. So, you guys let me know if you're currently playing my save game. If you've made any changes, let me know as well. And um, yeah, hopefully you guys are really enjoying it. I'm still really concerned about that now. I reckon that's going to come back as grass. Not what we want it to be. At least there's oats coming out of here. So I'm going to go with, once we get the money, uh, bailing. Certainly going to use the fortress here, the baler. Um, and then, uh, animals, we've got this guy here, which you can throw in straw, grass, or hay into this guy, and they'll spit it out the side, so, that's the plan with that, I think, I don't think we can run alongside this guy, because that, um, that header pipe is nowhere near wide enough, compared to where the actual header is. Try to sit right next to him. Just for that. Very, very close. Oh, it's completely empty. Let's get out of his way so we can do his old turnaround and we'll get back to our farm. Still taking our shortcut across our neighbour's field. I mean, I like that harvest. It looks good, sounds good. I just hope that that's really straw coming out underneath there, not anything else. Right, so we'll go and take what we can down to the horses here. At least I'll have some food. 
and then we'll um, come back, unload him again, and also take whatever's left to the sell point. Try and make some money, get some money back. We're going to need to buy a baler. We're going to need to buy uh, the water trailer we've already got. We're going to need to buy a baler and that sort of thing. We could probably take our car and go and get the water trailer, actually. Let's um, open you up. Let's go back into here and work out where we're going to tip this. The horse is coming over. It's getting very interested in what's going on. Is it this one? No. Look, we just killed the horse. So we do have the horse helper mod on as well. So the horses should not go anywhere. There we go, there's the oats. Tip them off. Not sure how much they're going to take. Ooh, all of it. Wow, okay. Yeah, 7,000 litres. Okay. Hungry little buggers. Oops. Right, we'll go through and we'll shut you so you just don't take off. What's our helpers here, our horse helper mod? So our helpers will come and ride the horses at midnight every night. We'll save us having to do it. So we'll go back now and unload our harvester again. We're still looking at putting in one of the water... Uh, water planes, I think, is it in this? No, it's in this one. The 50 by 50 with a trigger, so we're going to have to go like all the way down the back here, which is going to be like a massive water plane down there. Or we can just go with, um, whoop, off we go. Or we can just go with, where are you? Yeah. The, oh, the water station. That's what we can go with. What's that? Grain silo. I can put it in. Um, yeah, so. I think we'll put in just the uh, water tank. Still didn't get that bit. Why, why did you not get that bit? Seriously? So I'm not going to be able to unload you because we're driving through the crop. Let's just stop now. There we go. Thank you. Allow us to unload you and go and take whatever's left back to the horses. And you can continue on. A little bit short of what they need, but that should be more than enough. And we actually have an oat bag there as well, so chuck an oat bag into here. Uh, what is the price of oats at the moment, and where is the best price? Oh. Where is the best price? Uh, whatever that says, Gospodasto, something. How far away are you? Well, right as we head into town, so not too far, not too far actually. Um, yeah, just on the way into town, I think, yep. Right, so I'll do a run around this way. We can grab um, a bag of our horse feed. Don't throw that up Oop, on top. Not that. It's not going to work. Come on. Never work out. Try this bloody thing's going. There we go. Beautiful. Jump back into you. We're going. Unload. Over into the horses down the bottom here. What is that noise? It's a tractor, I think something else then. So we need to back back. 
hoping you don't you guys go anywhere at all. It's like, ooh, food. All right, what I've got to quickly do is change my screen for a second. Apologise. Um, there we go, back in. Probably only lost sound for a split second. All right, stay there. Go. No, no, no. Ooh, you're lucky. Let's go. Actually, while we're here, we need to rename these guys. Um, rename. We'll go. Oop. Lillian, after my daughter, of course. Uh, oops, no, untag, please. Rename. These are going to be race horses, so hoof hearted. Say so that really fast, I tell you. Uh, what's that? Uh, who you gonna move? Who you gonna move? Oh, I didn't fit. Who you gonna? That'll do. And, uh, okay, black, white, ning. There we go. Beautiful. Let's go. F has a full grain tank. Yes, we're on our way. We are on our way. So we need to go and grab um, our water trailer. We need to grab... Oh, what else do we need to grab? Something to load up the bales with. Or the straw, or the hay, or the grass, or whatever it is on the ground. I don't know what it is. I guess we'll find out. He's in the right spot this time. So we need at least 5,000 for our water tower. We need to get our trailer. We need to grab... Uh, probably, the, yeah, the baler to bail this. So we need a little bit of money, but... We should be alright. Once we get him emptied. Let's jump in our other tractor. At least you can start heading towards the shop, so you can grab the water trailer. If we don't have anywhere to get water from yet, at least you can head that way and hook him up, then we'll come back down and jump in this tractor and head on up and sell what we have in there at the moment. I don't think we'll get another full harvester out of um, the rest of the field, I don't think. So hopefully you guys have been enjoying the series so far. I, I know I've certainly been enjoying playing it. Um, a few things that have bugged me as you guys have seen, but for the most part, it's been enjoyable. Minus, as, as you see, the few things that sort of arise with mods and that sort of thing. I would um, like to know though, if you guys are playing the save file. Did you find all the mods okay? Um, and what have you done differently to what I've done this episode? Have you gone straight to cut down the trees? Have you gone to do something else? Did you max out your loan? Um, what what did you guys do? Let me know. That's it. That's it there. Okay. So does that take milk as well? No. Uh, yes, it does. Uh, yes, it does. Oop. You got spado. It does take milk. That shop reminds me of the shop from my summer car. I don't know why. It doesn't really look the same. Well, it sort of looks similar, but not exactly the same. So I've still been thinking about my own mod, um, map mod. I don't know. I think I can possibly, I will jump into somebody else's save game and just add to it. I think that's the only sort of thing I can think of that um, I can do. I'm not going to completely build my own map. I will take somebody else's save file, possibly Jones's Dairy, which I've been looking at, um, and just get rid of all of the home farm stuff, add all my own home farm stuff, adjust the fields a little bit, and um, God damn it, and then go from there. What makes you think you are finished, mate? What makes you think you're finished? got the tiniest little bit to go and you just can't be bloody bothered. Can we uh, try and 
here, there we go, close to this other, okay, the other pile of weird substance on the ground. Not close enough. Try and get it in the one big heap. Unsure on how fast this guy actually goes. 12, no, we 10. Or 9 even. No, 10. So we'll just follow him the whole way down. A little bit there to fix up. And we'll be finished. So it made pretty short work of the field. Let's see how we go. Look, getting stuck on the front of the harvester here. It's just pushing me through. Need like the tiniest little bit. Is he empty though? Right, that's fine. Let's not worry about that other bit there. Because there's going to be an extra bit that we don't really need. We don't want to take it anywhere, so. Um, we'll head this way. Head up to, obviously, the town. Take this load of oats in. Get rid of it. We'll probably get about 20, yeah, about 20,000. Wait, actually, maybe? Is that... Uh, where are we? No, 1,200, so... Yeah, 13, 14,000, maybe. Um, yeah, I'd say, yeah, good 13,000. So not a massive payday, but... Payday enough. Oop. Oh, watch out for their crop. Luckily we've got narrow tyres on. So a little bit of money, not a massive amount, but... It's a little bit. I need to um, try to remember to take a screenshot because I don't think I've taken screenshots in the last few episodes. Um, I sort of had to look at those little trees there. It's like a little tree farm. That's a good idea. Um, I sort of had to come back in after I've saved and uploaded and gone, ah, oh, shit, I don't have a thumbnail. Come back in and take a random thumbnail or something that probably isn't even part of the, the farm or anything. So. Yeah, I might um, try and back this guy in. I'll get rid of that. We know where we're going. Back this guy in and we'll um, take a thumbnail of this. A screenshot of this. It's turned into a thumbnail. Oop, that was terrible. Watch out for the guy walking across the road. Watch out for the neighbor's fence. So, so we'll grab a screenshot. Don't have the action camera installed, so I need to look at that later on. Done. 13, 2, 2, 7. Sorry. If you stay on that side, I'll stay on this side. No one coming. There we go. Right, so we'll head back to the farm with this guy. We need to get our have a quick look our yep cultivator back out. Set him down, get him cultivating again. Um, gonna run at times five. We should always run at times five, I suppose. Um, run at times five, and then get the field planted. Make sure, yeah, plant withering is off, that's fine. Just in case it grows different to what we're ready to harvest, that sort of stuff. So half the field's grown, ready to harvest, the other half's not. A lot of times it's already one half's withered, one half's ready, so we need to try and avoid that. Actually, we don't need to go and cultivate yet, we need to buy that baler. So we'll need to drop this guy back at the farm. Sorry run over people's crops. Drop this off at the farm, which is just here. I'll quickly jump in here and go bailing. Buy you. Drop this guy off back in here. So I've put oil slicks down on the ground, you can see there. Makes it a little bit dirtier, the ground. 
to drop you off. Shut you down for this this second. We'll go water station. Now, where is this going to go? Um, let's put it like here somewhere. I think here will be a half decent spot. Boom. We don't need to adjust them. Anything on the ground as far as paint wise. Okay, so we've got that. We've got something to. Well, we've got the bale trailer. Um, no, this isn't the front loader. We need to grab the front loader attachment before we go. Grab the, actually, no, we've got the bale forks there already, so we don't need to buy bale forks either. But we will need to possibly buy a shovel. So I wonder if. This guy will be strong enough. What do we need? 50 horses. We have 65 horses. So this guy is certainly strong enough to do the bailing. So we can bail with this tractor. Um, uh, yeah, so we can bail with this tractor and get the other tractor on loading the bales. Bit of lag there. Not sure because we're not gonna have anything ready to sort of stack. I think I do have um, the auto, yeah, this one, the auto load square bale. So we can use that guy as well, uh, which I didn't even get to see the price because I knew I was gonna hit the tree. 16 grand, so we don't have enough anyway at the moment. But for future reference, we can use that as an auto loading bale wagon if you want to go that way. Otherwise, we'll load them individually onto the trailer. We also need to pick up that other machine, maybe. We'll, we'll wait and see what um, what that comes back as on the ground when we go to pick it up. Is it hay? Is it straw? Depends on what texture he has in the map itself. It could be straw, then it could be hay, it could be grass. I don't know, but it certainly doesn't look like straw. Okay, we'll start loading this up with water. Shame that the hoses don't actually attach to the tank, but that's fine. Head you back to the shop. Go and pick up our baler. Come back down. Try and get a little bit of bailing done before the end of the episode. still want you guys to let me know the size of the episodes, 30 minutes, are you happy with that? 45 minutes, happy with that? You know, you guys let me know. I'm more than happy either way. But so I'll, um, I'll let you guys decide what you want to see and what you don't want to see. So I think well, we're up episode 21 already, it's just time flies. really, really does. Um, next time we start a series, I don't know whether we should just have one series running, like just do a Rags to Riches series every single day, or do it as like we've got now, Marble Manor, one day, Rags to Riches the next. You know, you guys, let me know what you think. I'm more than happy either way. Um, as far as our multiplayer server goes, Still looking at it, I might just do a multiplayer server on the Western Australia map. Um, that'll be probably the only thing I can think of. Alright, so swing in here, pick this guy up. Uh, yeah, on the Western Australia map until. Oh, Jesus. Until we find um, something else that we can do, um, whether it be my own map, possibly maybe one day, or whether it be something else later on, but I think the WA map would be good for multiplayer because it's such a massive, 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 massive map with massive fields. We certainly need, as a time, certainly need more than one person. 
on the farm. Right, wage payment. So we'll go down, we'll set this guy up, ready to go. We'll see what um, that field is actually classed as with um, whatever's left behind, whether it be straw or something else. We'll empty our water off into our horses to make sure they're sort of happy. Ah, oh, where are they? So they've got oats, they're at 5%. Five, five I don't know if they need more than just that to sort of go up every day. Have to wait and see. Um, also, before we end this episode, I want to go in now quickly and go to no animals. I do want to buy this guy, buy you, and the bale fork, just in case we do need it. And go from there. All right, so let's unfold this guy. Switch him on. Go down this way. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Fingers. It's straw. Awesome. It's exactly what I wanted to see. At least we know we're going to be picking up the right thing. Look at that. We're smashing out the bales too. We're going to get heaps of bales from this field, which is good. It's exactly what we need. Still only got two grand in the bank, so we don't really have any money for like a bale storage shed or anything yet. Um, it might have to be stored outside somewhere. So we'll um, take a look at that as well. I don't mind having them stored outside, but... Sort of um, up to you guys whether you think we should or we shouldn't. Alright, so I'll line ourselves up this next side. And um, shut him down. Go and jump in our other... Tractor. Now, Rakovica 65. I don't know if we'll be able to unload water from outside. No. Just kind of hoping that we'll be able to. Seeing as though we could just run a hose through the fence, but anyway. We'll have to back in. Oop. Where. Who you gonna? And Black Lightning is. There we go. We've got Lillian and Hoof Hearted on the other side. We put that. No. Is that enough? Yeah, it is. Okay. But that's not very much. Right, let's go around this side. I wonder if we can actually just back into the fence without actually having to. Take that down. Nah, no, that's what we're going to have to. Alright, there we go. Let's back it in. Unhook the water hose. Get him hooked up. Unload it in there. There we go. So now they need some straw, which we'll bring up very, very soon. Let's um, go and grab, um, I think if we run this, whoop, slide in there, fill this, it's not going to try and fill it from there, might have to actually go around the front where the trigger is, which would be interesting, there we go, drop you there, we'll go and hook up this other trailer, I don't know where we're going to store all this stuff. I might just store it at the front of the shed here. Um, back this up. Hook you up. Swing you around. So swing you around. We're going to need another or a bigger bale trailer, I think. The amount of bales we're going to get from this field. Right, so I'm going to unstrap these guys I'm gonna go chuck you sort of just down here uh, we we'll have to spin you around so we can so we know what's in it there we go you can go there uh, this lime bag can go over 
just next to our lime station because we know we're going to use that. Uh, drop this down. Chuck him there. Chuck this guy there as well. There we go, good. Um, grab this one. And this one we will just sit in front of them, I think. Right in the centre. Bam, there we go. Get this guy down in the field, ready to put the bales onto. Right here, guys, we'll end this episode here. As always, if you liked it, hit the like button. Leave a comment, as I said, during the video. If you like, if you're new to the channel and haven't subscribed yet, guys, please do so to follow our Rags to Riches series. Big Brito, thanks for watching. See you again soon.